Let's learn how to load a bundle of arguments into an intent and retrieve the arguments from the target activity. A bundle is a data structure of key value pairs passed between activities. You pass arguments between activities by loading them into the bundle. You pass arguments between activities by loading them into a bundle. The keys must be strings, and values are limited to the simple types and serializable objects which align with Android's rules for what you're allowed to pass between activities. Bundles have put and get methods for simple types. There are about a hundred put and get methods available, which makes a bundle class convenient to use for simple types like integer, double, bool, string, etc. Objects must be serialized to be stored in a bundle and passed between activities. Bundles support two ways to serialize complex objects. Android's parcelable interface, or Java's serializable interface. Implementing either of these is challenging, and the details of how to code these is beyond the scope of this course. Extras are bundled inside an intent and passed between activities. The intent used to start an activity is passed to the target activity. The target activity can then use its intent property to access the extras inside it and retrieve the arguments passed by the source activity. There are two ways to load intent extras. One way is to create a bundle explicitly, fill it with data, and then load it into the intent. Alternatively, there's an easier way. The intent class has methods that automatically create a bundle inside the intent and load the data all in one step. There are also two ways to retrieve the arguments passed to an activity. You can explicitly step all the way to the bundle using intent.extras.get with the desired extra ID, or you can use a convenience method in the intent class itself, which yields shorter code such as intent.getExtra and the extra ID. A common place to work with these intent extras is in the target activities on create method, since extras are often needed to get the target activity ready to use.